So these demos are going to be using a vacuum chamber. What a vacuum chamber is, is it's a chamber, in this case a bell jar right here, and we're going to use a pump to remove all of the air from inside of that jar. So if I turn it on, it pumps air out, and then I can open the valve here to let air back in. Now, with nothing going on inside the jar, that is not a very impressive demonstration. But we have a couple things that demonstrate the air leaving the jar very well. This is a noisemaker. I'm going to turn it on in a second, and it's going to make a lot of noise. But it also has a light on it. So I'm going to go ahead and flip it on. And I'm going to put it in the jar. You can still hear the noise that it's making, but obviously it's a little bit muffled since it has this thick glass jar all around it. So you can see the light and you can hear the noise. But when I close up the vacuum chamber and pull the air out, as the air comes out, it gets quieter and quieter and quieter until eventually it can't be heard at all or just very, very quietly, because there's no air in there. The sound waves that the noisemaker makes have to have a medium or a material for the wave to travel through. So if you want to hear the noisemaker, there has to be air to carry those vibrations. Without the air in there, you can't hear the noise anymore. You can still see the light though, because the light's not a mechanical wave. It's an electromagnetic wave, which doesn't require a medium. So the light will shine just the same no matter what, but if you remove the air, then the noise stops. If we open it up and let the air back in, it gets louder, more noticeable again. And when I pull the jar off, obnoxiously loud. <laughs> 